Smith's Modestry. Liberty sows its seed at Farm Point Farms. Hey guys, it's Eric, owner of Far Point Farms here in the mountains of North Carolina. And this is pretty cool. This company reached out to me and said, hey man, we'd love to send you a solar light for your flagpole. Now, that's pretty awesome because I have a flagpole and I bought a LED light that kind of like shines up, but it's always getting slightly off of position and then it doesn't light up at all. This one's totally different. This one here, you take down the flagpole, you put this thing in line with the flagpole, and it's always shining down. Can't get out of uh, adjustment, man. So very cool. And not much to it. Check it out. So, <laughs> so cool. Solar panels. Little teeny weeny solar panels, right? Hmm, that's a little smaller than my flagpole is. I'll have to see. Um... I'll have to see how that's going to fit on there. There's probably some adjustments you can make on it, but there it is. I'm just going to sit on top of my flagpole, light the flag up at night. A lot of LED lights there. So uh, I'm going to, it's snowing like crazy today, so I'm not going to be able to do it today, but I'm going to do the magic <laughs> of video editing. I'm going to install this thing on the flagpole, and uh, I'll show it during the daytime, and then we'll give it a chance to charge up, and I'll show it on another night. So let's go ahead. Look at that. We're going to take those off there. So we'll charge it up and we'll check it out. These guys were super kind, man. Not only did they give me this to review, but they gave me the opportunity to give one away to one of you. So if you have a flagpole and would like to, uh, to get one of these things, just give me a comment in the comment section below telling me why you would like to have one, and I will enter you in for a drawing. We'll give that away here, you know couple weeks. Sound good? Right, so so uh, I've taken the uh, top off of my pole here and it unscrews. Check that loose. Ooh, it's cold out today. And we've got this before I put it on there. Let me just show you once it detects that there's no light. Uh, the beautiful lights come on. Isn't that nice? So we'll slide that through. And there's enough room to reinstall this. I don't want to set it like that. I'm going to put this screw back on. We're ready to reinstall this. I don't know how well it'll show at night. Um, I don't really have night shot on this camera, but... We'll take the camera out tonight after I show you what it looks like, and we'll try and see it lit up. Cool. Got it. All right, here it is installed on the top. Doesn't take up a whole lot of room. And I got my flag, which is a little torn from the wind, but we usually replace them every March. They freeze to the pole, so once a year we put a new one on there. For those of you who are noticing that I fly the Don't Tread on Me flag instead of the U.S. flag, before you start complaining, you might want to take a look down there at the 8 by 12 foot flag that I have down there. And what you can see behind you is the 13 stars and another 50 star flag right behind there. So save it, save it. I'm going to go ahead and put this thing back up and we'll try it out at night. That's it. We'll try it after dark. All right, pretty awesome. Let me see if I can zoom in on a little bit here. Pretty nice. In fact, really nice. I like it a lot. And the wind's blowing beautifully right now, so you can see it pretty good. But, yeah, I'm real happy with this thing. It's pretty cool. Way better than the light that I had that reflected up from the bottom. So, pretty cool gadget and uh, not too expensive either. Anyway, that'll do it for today. We are going to give one of these away. So, all you have to do to get one of these things is leave me a compelling comment. And out of the comments that are not just, wow, cool, but hey, I really want one because I fly 35 flags in my house, which I fly about 15 here in the property. No, I'll enter you to win. And if you win, you'll get one too. Um, we'll do the drawing, I don't know. We'll call it two weeks from today. Take care.